Hi everyone, just wanted to share a few journals that I've um, made recently, some Christmas journals. I wasn't going to do any Christmas journals and then I realised I had all this fabric and tags and bits and pieces that I've made so I thought I'll might as well do a few. I've already sold one um, and these are available on my Etsy store. I'll put the link down below. So just wanted to show you them fairly quickly. I'll flip through them. So this is one, I love this. This is a Tim Holtz Christmas fabric. Um, so they're fabric, but they've got um, sturdy cardstock on the inside. So if they've got substance, they're all closed with uh, satin seam binding. There's this one here. This is stamped um, onto seeded calico and frayed and sewn, a bit of um, hessian burlap. And I've used micro beads as well, just to give it a little bit of sparkle. So it's plain on the back. They're all sewn, all threads are left hanging so they can be trimmed off if you don't like that look. Um, this has just got like a paper and fabric collage, some corduroy covered brads, um, some beautiful gold, gold, red and green fabric there as well. So that's them. Um, okay, so I'll just quickly go through them for you. Just need to make sure I'm in frame. I'm sorry if it's a bit shadowy as well. I don't have my normal setup because I've just moved and I'm not um, set up properly yet. So this is the best I can do at the moment. So I hope it's it's not too bad. So this one I've just torn a fabric strip and sewn a ruffle down on the side there. I have a pocket here. So all the tags are either coffee dyed and sewn or inked. I'll put the link down below to um, if I can remember who I got the um, printables from. So these are printables here that I've put on heavy cardstock. Just done a collage there. And the papers um, are Kaiser Craft paper as well. Stenciled throughout them all um, with the star stencil. Um, so they've got tabs and pockets and little um, journaling spots that I've made all through. It's the back of a paper bag that I've got in there. So I've just made that into a tuck spot and done a little collage there. This is an old cover for some music paper um, for Christmas carols. I only had the cover. I don't know where the rest of it's gone. So I thought I might as well use it. Um, so yeah, everything's sewn. It's just a, um, a bit of fluff there, digital stamp fabric tab I love fabric um, if you've seen my previous um, videos I'm a, a quilter as well so I love incorporating fabric and paper together it's beautiful it's just a large tag some Edith Holden December paper. This is just a Christmas card. So lots and lots of room to keep your traditions and memories for Christmas. And you probably wouldn't even fill this up in one Christmas. You could do it a couple of years in a row. So that's just a um, belly band there. Just a tuck. Isn't he? This one I've just added lace and, and rickrack and I've just got a um, bulb pin there with a little gold bell and a um, gold disc. And these are old as old. They'd have to be nearly 20 years old these. I think I found them the other day. So they, um, it's one thing about moving, you find things you forgot you had. So they're quite good. They're just little clips. This is just a napkin that I've decoupaged onto the paper. Put lots of photos and that on that. So it's just another tuck and just an envelope. Just some paper, coffee dyed paper that I've put on there. You could do a letter to Santa or you can write some hidden journaling about your memories for Christmas. 
I'll just put a little label on that one as well. So just some bits and pieces that you can stick throughout your journal. I'm not sure where these came from, sorry. These are just all bits and pieces that I've found. journaling spot those. so I hope you've all been keeping well I've been missing for a little while just a fabric flip there um, I can't wait to get back in and be more creative I've really missed it so these were a bit of fun to put together some of that Tim Holtz um, wallpaper I've just done as a flip there. And this hinges out and it's just another little notepad that I've made there so you can do some hidden journaling. This is just a pocket, a, um, what do you call them? Project Life card. Found these gorgeous tiny little um, index cards. I think at Daiso, I think it was. Love that shot. So I've just done that with a little tab, so you can pull that out. It's just another little piece that I've hinged on there with some fabric. Another little booklet. So I hope everyone's going to be having a nice Christmas. I know that there's people that don't have family, unfortunately. Um, I wish I could take everybody in and, and give them a nice Christmas, but it's a bit unrealistic. But um, yeah, hopefully you can give. Hopefully we can all give to someone that needs it and, and be kind to them for this Christmas if they're they don't have their loved ones around them so so that's that one um, sorry I'm trying to be quick just this is this one they're all very similar they've just got different um, well that's my business card that I just got done that's just another one that I've printed out onto heavy cardstock these are Kaiser craft papers again out. Found all these beautiful bags too that um, I've got the gold spots on them. They're beautiful. This is another pocket. Let's get some stamped and inked tags. So here's one of these clips here. So I've just got that clipped over the page. beautiful um, fabric journals that I'm working on at the moment that I'm going to do um, nature themed so I'm excited about that keen to get into them okay. once again this one's got lots of space for journaling as well keeping all your beautiful traditions and memories just popped some washi tape in there that you can utilize throughout as well digital stamping, another one of those Christmas cards and this one I've stenciled through out as well. It's just a tuck there. Eat of holden paper and just another belly band. It was the night before Christmas and went through the house that says. Just some writing paper. one of these had fallen off. I'd pulled one off so I didn't know where it went. So this is obviously where it belongs. I'll just clip that back on there. So this is just a hinged card there again. It's a little tuck spot with some cute little journaling spots. Decoupage the napkin. And this is a centre I've just put two big tags. You don't have to have these bits in there if you don't want to. Um, and then 
I've just made a little, another little hook there. It's another pocket with the, the bolt pin and the little bell and the disc. Another envelope. So this one's just blank paper in that one. lots of little hidden spaces too to put precious photos and memories. That's just a card. This is a bit of um, Edith Holden paper. It's just a bit of um, paper for some more hidden journaling or letters. there. This is a tuck, you can put a, something under there if you like. So lots of fabric tabs, lots of fabric included in them. It's just one of those big Prima tags that I've stamped on and added some satin seam binding. So that's a tuck as well. Let's get under there. Another stamped tag. That's the back of the um, that bag that's in the front there, and I found these beautiful little vellum sheets that I had as well. So they're gorgeous. And so that's that one. Now the dog next door is going to bark, so I will quickly flip through this one. So this one's got your paper collage and a bit of cheesecloth there. of tags. I love him, he's beautiful. And these cardinals, once again it's Kaiser Craft paper. This is just another printed sheet that you can write more memories on. This is a tuck but this clip comes off and you can journal or add photos in there as well. It's just one of those um, Tim Holtz clips. Some wallpaper flip out. Just another one of those printables. Just got it tucked over the page there. And here. It's just another little booklet. I love making those booklets. It's beautiful. In there. Some more Edith Holden paper. Just another journaling spot there. It's a larger envelope. It's got a nice shimmer to it. I don't know whether you can see that. And it's just got some paper, printable paper on there as well. It's another tag. Some digital stamping. I've just used a little um, bits of washi tape there and made a little collage. Of little bags with tags in them. This is um, a strip of paper, and I've just made it into a pocket there, so it's just got that printable just so you can see the dove from the other side when you flip the page. Another little tuck and another hinged flip out there. Another envelope. My mum gave me all these red envelopes. So I thought, oh, when am I going to use them? So they're ideal for um, Christmas. So that was nice. Deck 
decorator there. It's just a tuck. I'm probably repeating myself. Sorry, I've stenciled through this one as well. Another tuck there. Another little belly band. This is just an envelope. There's nothing in that one, but I put all sorts in there. That lovely Christmas napkin that I've decoupaged there. This one I've actually put little bells in the centre. That's another little flip. And there's some washi tape in this one as well that you can decorate throughout if you wish. The back of that Christmas card. It's just a decoupage. Oh, sorry, a um collage there that I've done. These are just beautiful. Just another one of those large Prima tags. I just inked up and added a little um, fabric ruffle. And more bits and pieces there to journal on, add photos on. Digital stamp that one. It's a gorgeous little card. Cute as that. So another pocket that I've made. Just a tag. So they're quite full, but still lots and lots of space for journaling and journaling and memory keeping. So it's just a strip of paper there. So that's them guys, um, I hope you like what you see, as I said they're available in my Etsy store now, um, If you, I'll pop the link below if you wanted to go and have a look at them, and if you haven't already subscribed please do so, thank you to everybody that um, does follow me already, I really appreciate it, it just amazes me that you're even interested in, in these that I do, I love making them, so it's so good to be able to share them with you. So. Hope you all have a wonderful Christmas. It's not that far away. Um, please take care of yourselves and I hope to see you again soon. Bye-bye.